Hey everyone, Frank Gamer here. I just thought I'd give you a book recommendation. Uh, one of my favorite authors is Yasunari Kawabata. He's a uh, Japanese author. Um, he actually won the Nobel Prize in Literature for, I believe, the, the book uh, Snow Country, which I've also read. Um, but I'm going to recommend a book to you today that I found to be more compelling and interesting than Snow Country, which I, I think is probably a second best book. <laughs> I recommend this book, Yasunari Kawabata's Beauty and Sadness. Um, this book is about an author, <laughs> ironically, uh, it's about an author who had an affair with a teenage girl. Um, this is years later, and the girl's, I guess, protege, protege they call it, um, she wants revenge for the slight that that you know the the author gave to the girl after a little while um after the affair was over basically uh she's very pretty and i think that's part of it is that she wants to use her beauty as a weapon this book is amazing um i'm not going to talk too much about it because it i don't want to spoil anything but let me explain this if you've never read Yasunari Kawabata, be prepared for a very subtle approach to literature. The man, um, you know, he's one of the most interesting post-war authors Japan has to offer. Uh, he actually ended up um, with, with each of his books painting a picture of Japanese culture at the time, which bore with it many hints as to what was going on in the story, without actually disclosing what was going on in the story. It's very hard to describe. I, the word subtle I just used before. Um, subtle is probably the best description of it. If you think of how subtle an author can be in telling you something um, without directly forcing it down your throat, this is the guy who did this, you know, without saying that kind of thing, um, Kawabata does it amazingly. And I highly recommend him as an author, specifically this book, Beauty and Sadness. Again, I highly recommend Beauty and Sadness. Good book. Frank recommends it to you guys, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> no, but seriously, it's a good book. If you haven't read it, read it. Um, if you want to read something by him that's had more international celebration, read Snow Country. Snow Country for Old Men. No, it's just called Snow Country. No, if you're interested, just read Snow Country. Um, but I highly recommend Beauty and Sadness over Snow Country. I think it's a better book. People will disagree with me on that. It doesn't really matter. I just I just love Kawabata. So, like this video, like, comment, subscribe. Leave me a little note saying whether you've read them or not. If, if you're interested, I don't know. I, I might do more book recommendations in the future. I've got a lot of them. Um, some of them are okay, I guess. <laughs> Let me know if you want more book recommendations. I'll try to make them in the future, okay? Thanks.